Hello and welcome. It is Nerdy Dren and I am back with another video of Astro Medica. So, I uh, I should update that I did a few things off camera. Uh, I guess I was tweaking my mic here a little bit, so I was trying to organize the recording and then I did a bunch of gameplay. I forgot to record it and so I like restarted the save, caught up to where I left off, and um, here we are. So where we left off last time was we ended up getting the jetpack, the backpack, the mining tool, as well as the oxygen capsule. Uh, we went down and collected a key card from uh, this other location over here, marked at 180 meters. And... Um, so yeah, I didn't have enough room to grab everything from there. So I think we're going to start off by heading over there and grabbing what uh, we left. So let's do that. Let's head over there. Um, I really appreciate everybody watching the other video. Uh, so this actually should be the second video that I upload um, in this Astromedica series. I am having a lot of fun with this game. It's pretty cool. Just like traveling through space and, you know, you don't get to experience this every day. That's for sure. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, last time we were like missing a bunch of materials, uh, but we found out that there's silver in this uh, area that we're heading into. And, uh,. So we're going to want to get more of the silver, and I believe there were some things in here that we didn't get just quite yet. Aha. And then that's where the key card was. Um, here's some fabric. Light bulbs. Cool. And uh, I think I got everything here. Oh. Ooh, oh, that that makes more sense. Now we have the builder and the laser tool. I think last episode I was trying to figure out how to build that habitat room and all that stuff up there. So now I got it. Now I understand. So we can build that stuff now, which is really cool. I'm excited to start building stuff. Um, and I guess we need that laser tool. Or did it say scanner or laser? I can't remember right now. Uh, I think it's up here. Let's check it. Scanner tool. Okay, so we'll have to get that. Um, and let's collect whatever we left off in here. We have all these iron bars, so let's get those. And that concludes our space. So if we want to come back and grab that stuff, we can. But I kind of want to make the um, mining tool and that what was it, the laser I got? Yeah, whatever that was. Oops. That wasn't supposed to work, happen like that. Oh, what do you mean inventory is full? Okay, let's just drink some of that, whatever. It's okay. I kind of want to maybe change the key bind for uh, switching the battery. Because I accidentally always just like, uh, when I'm trying to crouch, I bring up that battery uh, menu and gets a little bit annoying. But uh, I think we'll be okay. Or <laughs> we'll just get better. <laughs> I like how they just use a pillow for the fabric. <laughs> it's like instead of just having the fabric it's like here's the whole pillow <laughs> awesome alright we're back now so we want to see what we need to make uh, oh we can make the flashlight module let's just make that we'll make this builder tool right away and for this laser tool, we're going to need nickel and gold bars. Okay. I don't know where to get gold yet, 
but uh, we'll have to find that. Can we equip the flashlight? We can. And let's equip that hammer. And I'm assuming T, yes. So T will turn on our flashlight. Uh, let's put away most of this stuff because I don't think we'll need it just yet. And we'll put the rest over here. Okay, that'll be okay for now. So, we want to build, uh, I guess, this habitat room first. And then we can attach the corridor and airlock to it. Oh, and a window, I guess. So, let's grab that iron bar and copper wire. So, we got three of them there. I guess we need one, at least, of copper wire. And we had more. Okay. Oh, we don't have enough copper or iron bars. So do we have any of the ore? We can... Nope. Is that silver? That looked like silver. Okay. Well, we're going to have to get a couple more uh, iron and smelt that into bars. And then we can make our habitat room. Which will be good because then we can have our own little base. And we won't be just like staying at this random one that we woke up in <laughs> i still don't know how we ended up here but oh well you know can you imagine if it was just like a really crazy party that we went to last night and then you just wake up and you're like hey you're in this like you're in the middle of all this space debris <laughs> and uh and yeah go get all the metal just collect all the metal that you can <laughs> <laughs> and uh and survive just try your best <laughs> okay so we got some iron Let's smelt that down and we could probably make a corridor now yes we can so let's decide where that's gonna go i think it should just go pretty close right let's just stick it right here down in the corner uh let's go a little further down how about right Ooh, we can make it further away so we have a better i like that let's rotate this a bit so it's kind of in line with this thing uh i don't know if we can get it exactly in line well that's not cool i really wanted it to be well that's like oh yeah that's in line okay we're gonna we're gonna continue it like that we're just gonna stick that right there I like that spot for it. And how do we make the airlock? Fabric and more iron bars. Okay, we can collect more iron bars. Get this quartz. And that. And I guess we can mine the iron now. So, like, what is this? This is probably, uh... Oh, yeah, we need to replace that battery that we accidentally pulled out. Let's do that. Um... <laughs> of course we don't have the battery. And we can't exit the screen or what? Oh, okay. The battery must be around. It's got to be, right? No? Okay, we'll just have to make one. Wait, is it a power cell or a battery? Oh, power cell is a large energy storage device. And a battery will be used for tools. Okay, so copper and coal. Copper wire and some coal perfect let's make a battery and we'll stick that in our miner and now let's go grab some iron so let's look for some that that looks like some right here just floating away in space there we go that was just three of them which i think you need three per bar which is actually Considering how fast we're collecting it, I don't know. I'm having a hard time deciding if it's uh, better, or I mean, if it's like effective, efficient, or not. <laughs> okay, let's collect, let's just use that, smelt that down, and uh, let's try and see if we can build the next part of our hut <laughs> our space hut okay so builder and for the airlock oh we need the fabric for that and we need wire so let's grab some of this 
and we'll take the rest of that wire. Uh, let's stick the airlock on this side. Yeah, because then, you know, it'll be easy to access. And uh, let's, let's go check the inside of this thing out. Cool. Okay. It's pretty dark in here. Can we make a window? We need glass. How do we make glass? I'm assuming quartz. Let's go back up to our workbench. And uh, let's try to do that. Ooh, let's get in here. Sorry, it's my first day. <laughs> I guess second day. And I was right, it is quartz. Um, let's just melt any of the quartz that we have. Let's get all that. Let's make, or I mean, make some glass out of it and put some windows. Let's, uh, let's do that. Let's go in here. Can we build the corridor? No, we need more iron for that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A large habitat room. I'm okay with that. Let's build one of those too. I want to build a window. Where do I want to build a window? Right here. Let's do that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can we do another one? Yeah. Two windows on both sides. I like it. I like it a lot. Look at this. Cool. Okay. Now we should collect uh, some more iron and some more copper. Let's get that uh, other habitat room, the large one, built. And then I think we need to get, like, power or something. Uh, I noticed that there's like solar panels over here. So I'm, and I've seen like people on other YouTube videos get like solar panels and stuff on their habitats. Is that what we're going to call it in this game? A habitat? Is that a jellyfish floating? It looks like it's a jellyfish. A space jellyfish over there. That is very strange. All right, well, I don't know if I want to go anywhere near that thing just quite this second. But uh, let's see if we got enough copper here to at least smelt some bars. Just a few at least. Okay, is that enough to build our corridor? Oh, we <laughs> that's right, we need iron bars for the corridor. But for the large habitat room, we need four. That means we need one more of the copper bars... And we need some iron, so let's just uh, get what we can here. And I see a bunch of iron right here to my left, so we should be able to collect all that. Oh. <laughs> see, it seemed like it was like little small pebbles until you try to get close to it, and you're like, oh, that's a little further away. And they're actually just big blocks. So let's just mine as many of these as we can. Uh, I am trying to be a bit conservative with the oxygen tanks. I guess for once, I guess, when I'm ready to uh, maybe do one of these longer adventures. Uh, I'm not really sure about any like space vehicles, spaceships, or anything of that nature. Uh, but until then, uh, I'm just going to try to, like, you know not need it and just keep up with it <clears throat> head back when i need to we should be we should be good to go we need one more of those right and keep smelting iron bars and does that mean we could build our corridor now we can and we i don't know if we'll have enough to build both the corridor and the habitat room but let's just build the corridor and then get some more iron so tape put this corridor right there, and then we're going to put the large habitat room right at the other end. Oh, look at that. We got a bunch of uh, bunch of new blueprints, hey? Okay. Small habitat and a solar panel. We were just talking about that. Awesome. Okay. We'll have to build that and uh, get some power, and then we can start, I guess really getting into it <laughs> all right let's go smelt the rest of these into some bars how many did we get we got a few 
we might have enough to build the large habitat room. <clears throat> All right. And more iron bars. Ooh, I don't think that was enough. I don't think it was enough. Okay. <clears throat> well, let's go into our new house, our new habitat. Oop, 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 oop. I'll get better at this whole flying in space thing. <laughs> Look at that. It's like a whole little corridor. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. I'm going to end the video right there. And uh, next time we'll build the large habitat room and uh, continue building with this and adventuring through space. Thank you for joining me. I am Nerdy Dren, and we'll catch you next time.